This is Dabu 7, and in this instance, it truly begins here as we have reproducing robots that have been made here by a team of scientists, the University of Vermont, the same team here that is responsible for building xenobots that they assembled from frog cells so back in 2020. The same team has discovered that these computer-designed and hand-assembled organisms can swim out into their tiny dish, they can find single cells, they can gather hundreds of them together, and they can assemble baby xenobots inside of their Pac-Man-shaped mouths. And then a few days later, they become new xenobots that look and move just like themselves. And this is pretty wild. Now, go over here to a video clip showing these things in motion. And you can see here, as it's moving around, these things go around, pick up a cell, stack them, and then literally create a whole new organism. They're saying that this is profound. And remember, they have the genome of a frog. Okay? Now, scientifically, what can come out of this? Who knows? As far as your imagination can run with this. In this world, I don't see these individuals that come up with this stuff ever doing things that are really good. It's always about control, 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 and very little in the positive is put out there. So, you wonder why we talk about the nefarious stuff that they can do with, this, with these things. It's because of just this. If one of these things was to get let loose inside of you or in any other circumstance, it could wreak havoc. But this is the latest. It truly begins here. As these scientists have created living robots that can reproduce. I'm going to leave a link down below. Hit that subscribe button for more. Much love.